Well, as we begin fall, our tastes are changing. And so in today's cooking corner brought to us by Air Comfort Solutions, our friend Heather Berryhill shows us how to do a whole roasted chicken with lemon, potatoes and parsnips. Hi, Heather Berryhill here. Welcome back to my home kitchen. OK, it's National Family Meals Month and Reesers and I have gotten together to put together a easy one pan whole roasted chicken that the whole family's going to love. So let's get in the kitchen and get cooking. Let's get started building this chicken. I'm going to start with just some really small new potatoes and put those in the bottom of the pan. I've got an onion here. I'm just going to give it a rough chop and add it to the pan. I've got some fresh rosemary sprigs. I'm just going to throw those in the bottom of the pan. Now I'm going to chop up some lemon slices to put those on top and then I'll save some to put in the cavity of the chicken as well. Now I've got some parsnips. I'm just going to peel them. I'm giving the parsnips a really rough chop and I'll toss them in. And now I'm just going to season it with a little bit of Montreal steak seasoning. You can use any kind of seasoning you want. I just love the way this tastes. I'm going to put a few pats of butter just to make those potatoes and parsnips and everything even richer. Okay, I've got about a five and a half pound bird here. I've washed it, patted it dry, and I'm going to put in breast side up in the pan. Now I've got just some Chardonnay. I'm going to go put that all around the chicken. It just makes the vegetables even better. Now we're going to start shoving our little baby with all kinds of goodies. So I'm going to start with just some giant pieces of onion. Now some lemon. This just keeps the meat really moist and gives it flavor. I've got a um, whole bulb of garlic here. I've sliced it in half and I'm going to put half inside of the chicken. Now I've got some Italian parsley. I'm just going to put that inside the cavity as well. I've got some sprigs of fresh rosemary and fresh thyme and that's going in as well. She's full. I'm just going to give it a little douse of olive oil and kind of rub that all in. This olive oil is what is going to make the chicken really crispy on the outside. I'm going to take more of that Montreal steak seasoning and generously season the entire chicken. I'm going to try to get a little bit into the cavity. Okay, I am just putting pats of butter all underneath the skin. This will keep it so moist, juicy, and really make it flavorful. Now I'm going to put some little lemon wedges under the skin to give it that extra lemony flavor. Now I've got some thyme, rosemary, and Italian parsley. I'm going to put that under the skin as well. Now I've got some kitchen twine. I'm going to tie up the legs, tuck in the wings so they don't burn and get everything in a nice package. Okay, I've got my gorgeous five and a half pound bird here. She's going breast side up in an oven on 425 for anywhere between 45 and an hour and a half, really depending on the size. I'm going to start with 45 and check her and then if I need longer, I'll do that. So I'm just going to show you what the inside of this looks like. It is so incredibly juicy. I love that crispy skin on the outside. Ah, just look at that. So look at the tenderness on the inside of the chicken. So juicy, delicious. So there you have it, a whole roasted chicken with parsnips and new potatoes. The whole family's gonna love this one. For more recipes like this, go to the research.com website or follow me on Instagram at just me, Heather B. That food looks amazing as always. Again, all you have to do is go to our website for more.